So to balance this equation, K plus Cl2 yields KCl, we'll first write down all of the atoms on each side of the equation. So we have K here, the potassium, and we have one of those. Chlorine, Cl, we have two. Over here on the product side, K, we have one. Cl, we also have one. So the potassiums, the Ks, they're balanced with one on each side. It's the chlorines, we have two here and one here. If we put a two in front of the KCl, we'll have two times the K, so that'll go to two, but we'll have two times the Cl, and that'll mean we have two chlorine atoms, and the chlorines will be balanced. But now we have two potassiums here and one here. To solve that, if we put a two right here, the one times that two, that'll give us two, and we'll have balanced the potassiums. So now we have two potassiums here, two on this side, two chlorines, and two chlorines here. This equation is balanced. And you can report the coefficients as two, one, two. This is Dr. B, and thanks for watching.